Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name's Luce, if you're new. Um, today I'm going to be doing more of a summer look. If you follow me on Instagram and Snapchat, which by the way, all my social media links are down below. Um, I posted this photo a couple of days ago. I don't think it's on Snapchat no more. I'm not sure. But I'm just going to be doing a summer look because summer's coming up very, very soon. And I already did my face and my eyebrows. It's just a normal face. That's why I didn't want to show it. And plus, this video is probably going to be long because I'm going to try to do eyeliner on camera. I did it yesterday correctly, but I never done it on camera. So don't judge me if it comes out horrible or if I mess up because I won't be able to fix it. So yeah, let's get started. The first thing I'm going to be using is the Cinderella eyeshadow primer. You guys probably seen this before. Um, I'm pretty sure I showed this a couple times. I'm just going to take a little bit on my hand like that and just put it on my eyelids. Also, I have my mirror right here, so if you see me look over there, that's why. Um, this is kind of like a get ready with me, sort of, so it might be long. And if you don't like um, long videos, then just click out of this because I don't want any hate comments in the comments. So yeah, this is just going to help the eyeshadow stay for a long time. Now that I have something right here. Now that we have that on and you don't want your eyeshadow primer to clump up while you're blending your eyeshadows. I'm just going to be taking the Lorac Pro too. You guys seen this before. <clears throat> I love using this. So I'm just going to take Buff with a small little brush and just pack that on so that it, it could be used as a base. Like that. Now, the entire makeup look is used basically on the Too Faced peanut butter um, palette thing because you want more of an orange, reddish, gold, bronzy look for summer. And this is a full out makeup tutorial. So this is if you go out on a summer night to like a party or like anything like that or a dinner. This would be your type of look. For summer, I wouldn't wear much. I would probably just wear waterproof mascara and that's probably it. But you could also wear bright colors. It's up to you, honestly. Now I'm going to look for my brush because apparently it's not here. Um, okay, we're just gonna use this brush because I can't find it. This is just a small little um, traveling brush that I got. It just looks like that. I'm going to be taking peanut butter, which is just a nice transition shade. I'm just gonna be putting that in my crease and a little bit above my crease. I don't know if you'll be able to see that. This will just help everything blend out. And it's okay if you put a lot because you're going to be blending everything out. Very, very soon. Just like that. Now, to make that even more orange on the outside, I'm just going to be taking a brush like this. It looks like this. And it's like dense, but then it's like a flat top right here. And I'm going to be putting Nuts About You, um, which is a bright orange shade. And I'm just going to be putting this on the outer corner of my eye. Like so. And you could even put that above the crease, but don't go all the way too high. So that it still looks good. And then we're going to blend it. So if it looks like a lot of orange, don't worry. Because we are going to blend everything so that it looks perfect. Okay, the biggest part of makeup, you guys probably hear this a lot in makeup tutorials, is blending. It's so important so that it looks like a nice line and it doesn't look so harsh. Because if you just kept it like this, it would look... For my opinion, it won't look good, but that's just my opinion. Some people like it. Um, I just like to blend. I like using a clean brush. And I just go in a windshield wiper motion. 
like so. And I just blend all of it out. You can even smoke it out if you want to. I'm trying not to get any fallout because I did my eye makeup, my face makeup, but I don't have um, an editing software at this moment. So that's why I'm trying to go fast so that it won't be like a big deal. Um, I'm getting it soon, don't worry. And I'm also getting backdrops. It's just taking a while because school's almost over. So that's when I'm gonna have more time to film and everything because the last few days of school, everyone knows it's horrible because you have to keep on doing all of this stuff for school. Okay, so now that I'm done blending, that's it for eyeshadow. The last part of my eyes, I'm going to take a flat eyeshadow brush, which, where's the brush I used last time? Also, it's really hard for me to look from the brushes because my, bro my sister's broke my brush container thing so now it's all together i'm going to be taking this mac pigment i do not know what shade this is it looks like it says melon but i'm not sure because it's like worn off but it's just a gold color and it looks like yeah i'm gonna break it it looks like that and to make sure that i don't get fallout i'm going to be taking the mac prep and prime fits plus on a flat eyeshadow brush now I'm just going to spray this a lot so that it doesn't get all loose and fall on my face because that won't be happy. I did that last time, but since I had so much time, I was able to um, fix it. Now I'm just going to be taking a little bit of product, top off the excess because that's what would end up on your face, the excess. Looking like that. Now you could also put another coat of your base. Should I do another coat of my base? I'll just do another coat of my base. Just so that it sticks on there. Very, very well. Just like that. Now I'm just going to pack it on there. Don't wipe because that's what gets all over your face. Again, if it gets everywhere, don't worry, we're blending out because you could see that I did that very, very messy. And there you go. If you have a little bit of fallout, it's fine. I only got speck of glitter. There you go. Do that to the same eye, or the same eye, the other eye. And now that since you have all that on and it's not the best because if you could see, I didn't put it on very straight. But that's fine because you could just go back into the brush that has a little bit of product left and just blend out the side where you put that. So where your crease is, you could blend it out. You can even add more product. I'm gonna add a little bit more product just cause some of the um, stuff came off. Oh, there you go. And to make this more gold, this is a suggestion. I'm not going to do it on my face. But I have the MAC quad with a whole bunch of shades on it. These are the shades. If I could get it to focus. I don't know if they'll focus. But I think the color that I'm using is Aztec Brick. I'm not sure how to like read these names. Like which one's which. But I'm just going to be using a gold that's like almost gone already. These two are my favorite. If you could tell. This is just a nice gold color. And you could just pack it on a little bit. Just like that. Just to make sure that it stays. I might as well just do it so you guys could see. It doesn't add much color to it. But it does fix it up a little bit so that it's not so messy. 
And for the best part that I'm probably going to mess up on because it's on camera, I'm going to be using the Color Mates Liquid um, Eyeliner. This stuff is amazing. This is just in black. I'm a try. And if I mess up, then oh well, because this is all I got. Let's see if I could do it. See, but I want you guys to see it too. But I have to look in the mirror. This is not good at all. And then this video is going to be long just for me putting on eyeliner. So I'm just going to do a line. You could do a wing. Just know that I would have done a wing, but I don't want this video to be 20 minutes long, even though it's already 10. <laughs> it's very silent. And there you go. There's your eyeliner. Now you could have done more, but... Like a wing, it would look better, but this is what I got. Now using the Tarte Lights Camera and Lashes um, mascara, it got wiped off. This is just a sample. Love this mascara. It makes my lashes really long. Just like that. And there you go. Um, you could add lipstick. Um, this is just a like an example of a color I would use. This is the Moisture Renew um lipstick by um Rimmel. This is in shade one twenty coral shimmer. So it is a shimmery color, and it's just like a nice shimmery orange color. And there you go. That's the finished look look that I did. Um, I'm sorry I couldn't do wing eyeliner. I'm sorry this video is a little bit long. I just didn't want it to be really long of me trying to get the wings even. And also my, um, my summer videos are going to be so much better than the videos I'm making now because at this moment I have no time to film because I'm going places. I have stuff to do for other things and then projects for school and everything like that. So I'm sorry, but follow me on social media. Then you will be able to know if I'm posting this week or not. Um, summer's coming up in a few weeks. So that's a good thing. And I'll probably be posting more often during the summer. And maybe I'll start a vlog ch channel during the summer. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed. Um, I'll see you next time. Bye.